Well, she can cook, she can write, and now she can make movies. Is there anything Katie Lee cannot do? Her novel Groundswell has now been adapted into a Hallmark film starring Lacey Chabert, and it will have you feeling all the feels. Take a look. You are just another line cook. This is over. Did I just pack a bag and fly to Hawaii? So you came to Hawaii to find yourself. I came for surf lessons. Surfing is not just about the ocean. It's a way of life. He really helped me go home and take on anything that comes my way. And Katie joins me now. Welcome back. Good to see you. Thank you so much for having me back. I'm so excited to be here. And, and, and for a good reason, because, yes. I mean, how exciting is it for you to have a movie now on I Hallmark? Mean, I am pinching myself over this. It was such a long process. The book came out in 2011. Oh, and yes, then a few a years ago, my best friend's husband, Ricky Golden, he was a soap opera star for years. He's producing now. He said to me, can I take your book to Hallmark? And I was like, sure, go ahead. And that was five years ago. So oh this is has taken a long time to make it to the screen. So when, just for people who didn't read the book, tell mm. everybody what the story is about to start. So the book is about surfing and finding love and Emma, who Lacey Chabert plays in the movie, she kind of loses everything that she thinks that she wanted yeah. and that's how she finds exactly what she needs. And does any of this autobiographical? Um, well, you know, I started surfing years ago and I thought it changed my life and that's what inspired the whole story. Yeah, and when you found out that they were adapting it, were you just like, this so is... So excited. Yeah, this is amazing. And you even have a cameo in the I film. I do. You're used to being on camera, so was this <laughs> different? Well, I mean, it wasn't a big stretch. I played myself yeah. and I was judging a <laughs> yeah. culinary competition, but I was a little nervous and I had to memorize lines. And so, you know, and I'm opposite these great actors. So I, I, I was definitely a, a little nervous. Yeah, I mean, this was a labor of love for you. Like you said, it's that you wrote the book in 2011. So what was the whole process like for you uh, in, in turning this into a movie and then finally getting to see it completing around between takes but you're on the beach yeah. so. <laughs> pretty nice pretty nice day at work nobody cared but you, were you involved in the casting because I have to say that I loved Lacey and Hector their chemistry was great they were so cute mm -hmm. together as soon as I found out Hallmark was going to do the film I said please cast Lacey yeah I really wanted so her cute. to be Emma and I'm so glad that she was yeah. and Hector Rivera is fantastic and all of the actors just did such a good they job did. and there were several local people in Hawaii who were part of the cast oh, nice. and they were awesome yeah well you're not just making movies you're still co-hosting the kitchen yes, on Food I am. Network. you know what is what do you think it is that makes the the dynamic the, the duo or the the chemistry between it's not a duo it's four of you between you and Jeffrey and you know we're all really friends yeah and I think that viewers see that we really care about each other and we've spent so many years together now that we've become part of each other's families yeah we have a text chain where we're all writing each other in between times that we're filming and we're sending pictures of our families to each other and I truly love these people and I think that viewers feel that and they yeah. feel like they're hanging out in the kitchen with us. Yeah and probably nice that you guys are back in the studio because oh, it probably yeah. was a little more challenging during the pandemic and you were all coming from home. Yeah you know it, we were lucky that we got to continue to work yeah. but it's definitely better to be back together. Yeah any plans for a new cookbook from you? I'm actually working on a children's book that's I what I'm, that. I'm writing next. Well, that makes sense too. How's the little yes, one? Yes, my little girl's getting ready to turn two. I know everybody it says go it goes so fast. fast. I can't believe how fast it's been like this. I know. My youngest is five now, oh. and I'm like, what? Why did that happen? We just need to stop time. Just stop time. Slow down. I know. Play dates. Maybe. Yes, I'd love it. Yes, when your little one gets like a year older. <laughs> All right, well, you can catch Groundswell this Sunday at 9 p.m. on Hallmark Movies and Mysteries. Katie, good to see you. Thank you so much.